Polynomial functions, what exactly are they? When did they originate? Well, Rene Descartes back in 1637 had this new coordinate system. It was called the Cartesian coordinate system. And he used polynomial functions to model certain behavior on it. It was really the first time it was done. You say, well, that's great, but what is a polynomial function? It's a collection of terms that are added and subtracted. They have a coefficient, a variable, and the variable is raised to a power. And that power or exponent is a positive number, zero, one, two, three, and so on. A positive integer, that is. Take a look at these radio antenna that you see. Their outline is the shape of a parabola and they transmit radio waves. Uh, too vague, you ask? Well, how about this? Imagine you're shooting a basketball and when you shoot a basketball, what happens? Well, it goes up and back down, but that path is called the parabolic path. And that parabolic path is that of a path that models a quadratic function, a type polynomial function. In fact, the height of the ball, well, that's the vertex of that particular path. Here you see a polynomial function. And what it is, is a function that models the area of the garden that you see enclosed in the backyard. And notice, what does it have? It has a collection of two terms with a coefficient, a variable, and they're raised to a power. Welcome to the world of polynomial functions.